Hello and welcome back to another installment of Northern Coins. I greatly appreciate you watching these uploads. And if you like what you see and you're not already, please consider becoming a subscriber. But leave a like because it does help the algorithm. And also um, comment as well, please. Today, uh, a, a wee bit of post has uh, popped through the door today, but finally. Um, still waiting for my raw mint thing to come through, so because I've ordered a couple of things off the raw mint, so I'm still waiting for that to come through. But start off with this one some beautiful stamps on it as well. On these, so quite a few stamps must have been the getting rid of everything, but that. And then this um, submarine, a biplane, and probably what we'll be going back to once all the oil runs out. <laughs> Bit of politics. And then a little one here as well. So I'll start with this one. This is coin related. So I'll open this up. Is there anything else in there? No. In the raw mint, this. So as you know, I collect the. Um, oops, upside down. I collect the um, strike your owns, and this is the latest one for 2024. It's the one pound with the bees on, which is probably my favourite. And as we know, the bee is a symbol of Manchester. And as you know, I'm a Man City fan, so that's why I like this coin as well. So, in total, there's what, 20, uh, sorry, um, 41 strike your owns to uh, collect. I've got 40. And I bet you can guess the which, <laughs> which one I've not got. But, um, that's probably going to be coming up in a in the next uh, week, maybe fortnight, a coin, well, I'm being cryptic here, but it's not the strike your own, but it is the coin that, I suppose it's a bit like Marmite, but anyway, I'll leave that for another day, that. Also as well, I was watching uh, Macamoolas and he got the um, 50p book, but while I was there as well, I thought, I looked at my box and I thought slightly out of date. £2 on this one. This is the £2 uh, book as well. So it's got all the £2 in. Territories as well. Isle of Man. So I'm going to enjoy looking through this. Looking for the ones well worth uh, looking for. So, that's the book in, to in, in general, 2024 guidebook, I'll just put that to one side, uh, country, territories, UK, so it goes all the way down, it, 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 it lists everything really, but Like I said, there's the Britannia. Sadly, it's gone out. We didn't get enough of these, did we? We only got two into circulation, which is really is upsetting at times. But there you go. There are the prices of the Britannias. And they're the old ones as well. So, and then we go into obviously the best ones to find in your in circulation. No, no, sorry, that's the best one, isn't it? That one. How much is it worth? Proof 65 to 70, BU 60 to 65, circulated 35 to 40. So I'm sure you can. Well, that, yeah, that'd be about average, that wouldn't it? But it'd be interesting to have a look through these. All of these, which ones are these? So. All the ones there, a lot of the colourised ones as well. 
which is I'm not going to say to collect them and not collect them, it's entirely up to you. Yes, what's that one? The White Horse of Hanover. Mm. So, William and Catherine. And that's when he had a. <laughs> what year was that? 2011. He's not like that anymore, is he? Bit of a slaphead now, aren't he, William? But anyway, Arctic Territories, all of that. So, that's the uh, £2 book. I'm going to enjoy looking through that because I, the book I got was slightly out of date. It was 2020. So, and then this is the first time I've bought this book. Oh, thankfully I didn't record the stamps. I just, which is this one. This is the first time I bought this book. So I did see um, what Macamula was doing. And I thought, you know what? I'll get that book, see what it's like. I wonder what the silver proofs are like. I did notice them just. Obviously, we know about that one. Peter Rabbit, 270 to 360, then knocking. Jeremy Fisher. What's the biggest one? J uh, Jemima. That's 65 to 100. Peter Rabbit. Eating the carrots, Taylor Gross there, and the best Paddington one, and there's the snowman, the first one, yeah. And the, uh, they didn't, Gruffalo, which is surprising really, Gru uh, Gruffalo, it's only 25 in here, but Flopsy, how much is that, 18 to 35 it says there, so, hmm. Morris and Gromit, 30 to 50, and then the dinosaurs. I did start the first set and then the, I just stopped. It was just getting silly. I did do the Winnie the Pooh ones, 35 to 55, and Christopher Robin. I did like that one, Christopher Robin one. I, I thought that was the best one out of the three that year. Piglet, the dinosaurs again. Yeah, 2021, I think I'm missing that one, I'm not sure, I am missing three of the uh, snowmen, but I'm just trying to see, circulation, obviously the lower the circulation the more it will cost you. 2022 uh, Snowman and the Dog, as you can see, the circulation is 8,500, 85 to 105, which is about right, that I think. Silver proof there of the. Uh, I'm surprised by that actually. Gene TB, only 5,500, and it's saying they're 30 to 40, so I haven't looked up the prices of these, so. And then the uh, the different Commonwealth games. Oh, I've got five thousand. Oh, that had four thousand. The uh, that one. So the England ones twenty five. The Scottish ones um, twenty five. Four thousand on that. Mm. Like I said, they, uh, they went into Harry Potter's, how much are they? Are they keeping the money? The train one, really, isn't it? Hogwarts. Star Wars seems to be uh, holding the money pretty well. Not sure about the uh, Line of Witch in the Wardrobe. I never bought any of those. Snowman 2023, it's saying 70 to 90 at the moment. So, we'll see how that is. It's not the right time to buy it though, is it, at the moment? Isle of Man coins, we do like them, don't we? So. And, it, like I said, it goes to all of these. Just strike your owns. Obviously, it's not got the uh, 2024. The Salmon. 
the snowman, which is there. Pity we don't get, um, well, two things with the, um, <coughs> with the, uh, with the strike your nose is one, we don't get the mintages, and two, really, you can't tell if it is other than the packaging, which would be nice if it had a little privy mark where the, uh, the monarch is. And saying so we did get them. So, obviously, how much is it saying for the uh, Harry and Meghan? And I missed that one. Hold on, eh? Can't see it. 2000. Am I missing a page? Or is it not doing it? I don't think it's done it. I don't think he's done it. No. And it's, it's around uh, 2018, I think they got married. So, it's not in there for some reason. Strange. That is strange. And then the Brexit. I ended up getting that one. Finally got it. 30 to 40. I think that's a little bit conservative. That one. I paid uh, £30, maybe a little bit more. But finally got it. So that was one that I sort of stayed away from. But uh, anyway. And then we obviously go into all of these. So there you go. I've got both of the books now. So hopefully um, we can uh, have a bit of fun over the coming year. I'll uh, throw out a few more uploads. But have you got any of these? Have you got this one? This one. I'm not sure how long it's going to run for, but I think I paid just over £20 for that plus postage, so could it have cost me excess of £100 for the day, getting down there food and the tours, so to pay £20, £25 is not three bad is it? So have you got these? Let me know in the comments. But this is Northern Coin saying bye, bye now, and I'll see you next time. Bye.